Okay, a um, couple questions. Okay. Uh, sex advice from a porn star, because I know a lot <laughs> of men need it. Uh, so first of all, burning question, Let's so important. It. What is the ideal penis size for you? I love an average. Hmm. I love an average. Oh, really? So what's average to you? Like a six. Okay. Six and a half, maybe a seven. Because okay. I like to do anal like whenever I want. Mm -hmm. um, so when you have like a six or a seven, we can like do anal pretty easily. Mm -hmm. And I like, and I'll say this actually, my buddy Nathan Bronson has mm -hmm. the best feeling dick in porn. Mm -hmm. The best feeling. It just curves up a little bit. Like, mm -hmm. um, And he's not like a monster dick. No, but he's no, got no. like a great size. Oh my gosh, no, he has like the the best. I told his uh, his fiance, our friends. Mm -hmm. She thought she was like, oh my god, thanks. <laughs> but yeah, I saw photos of her. I I'd never seen her before, but she's beautiful. Oh my gosh, she's dark. Oh, oh. Really pretty. I love Nathan. He's such a nice. I haven't seen him in a while because I haven't shot boy girl in Aww. forever. But Nathan is so great. She's equally nice, actually. I gotta say. I'm sure. I'm sure. Um. So yeah, like a Nathan Bronson dick is like. Mwah. <laughs> Mwah, chef's kiss, Nathan, mwah. Yeah. Uh, okay, uh, last question. What are men doing wrong in the bedroom? I think that they're not being clear. Hmm. So one thing that's great about being on a porn set, and it's not the sexiest conversation, but it's a great conversation to have, is like they'll literally sit you down and say like, what do you like or not like? Mm -hmm. So people, it's very clinical but like people will literally come, walk up to each other if there's no checklist for that for the boundary, boundary checklist for and scenes, they'll say yeah. like hey like what are you into what do you yeah. not like blah 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 yeah so i think that's cool even if it's clinical it works in the long run yeah but uh i would just my best advice would be to be clear don't be shy and like tell them exactly what you want they will be grateful mm -hmm. yeah i mean it's like it, it's hard right because yes getting all that information out there, you know, would you would assume would lead to a better experience because mm. everybody's different. You can't really guess no. what someone's going to like. Yeah. We have the, you know, we're fortunate enough in the adult industry where, you know, now especially we have boundary checklists where yeah. we sit down and we, you know, the performance director, we all go over everything beforehand. Yeah. So, like, you know what you're getting into. But that's a job, right? Yeah. This is a profession. But, yeah, it's like, and I think that the Even movies. Even in my normal life, I, I ask that now. Well, right, because you have had this experience yeah. in adult and you're probably more comfortable with your sexuality yeah. and talking about it. But the everyday person, I feel. Is too shy to ask. Is too shy to ask. Like, and you get sold this idea in the movies that you're just going to run into each other's it's arms. Automatic. And you're going to know exactly what that other person wants. And there's this magic and everything's perfect. Mm -hmm. And then, of course. Because in the movies, you always orgasm at the same time. Oh, always. You never not orgasm. At the same time. Oh, wait. What, one thing I did learn this year, mm. I learned how to come on command. How did you manage that? Girl, I don't know. I just always heard that you could. But, like, I kept hearing, like, this could happen. So, like, it's funny. In my, in my videos, I'm like, oh, my God, don't stop. Don't stop. I'm going to come. I'm going to come. I'm going to come. And I actually do every time. Really? Did you, like, have – because that's a very – that's a mental gymnastics. It's a mental do. thing. Yeah. But I kind of just, like, I have to, it helps when the guy says it mm -hmm. and he chokes me. And then, like, if I tell myself, like, it's time to come. Mm -hmm. Okay. That's a great power to have. Oh, thanks. Some guys need to learn that. Come on command. Some, right. some of them take too long. <laughs> For real. For real. Hey, guys. If you want to support my show, then you should think about joining my Patreon. At my Patreon, I offer all kinds of amazing perks in exchange for your financial support. From live streams of my interviews as they are happening, to bonus Q and A's, behind the scenes photos and videos of my shoots, plus cool merch like stickers, mugs, and hoodies, we have you covered. So go to patreon.com slash hollyrandallunfiltered, and while you're at it, make sure that you click that subscribe button so you don't miss a single one of my new updates.